Who is Poe Dameron and is he force sensitive? Before we explain his possible force sensitivity, let's talk a little bit about who Poe Dameron is. Poe Dameron was born two years before the Battle of Endor to ace pilot Lieutenant Shara Bey and Sergeant Kess Dameron. Shara Bey heroically and triumphantly fought beside Luke Skywalker and Princess Leia in what could rightly be deemed as suicide missions. Kess Dameron fought in a special forces unit called the Pathfinders under General Han Solo. In the words of Kess Dameron, they were the first in and the last to leave. Fast forwarding to Poe's adulthood, we find Poe disillusioned with the Republic's inaction to the First Order's violations of the Galactic Concordance, which led to his defection to the Resistance, where he became one of General Leia Organa's most trusted operatives. Poe Dameron flies under the call sign of Black Leader, while piloting his specialized T-70 X-Wing fighter Black One. And that brings us to The Force Awakens, which I will not spoil for you if you haven't seen it. Now let's dive into whether or not Poe Dameron may be force sensitive. Poe demonstrates exceptional skill and confidence as a pilot. It's almost as if he's 10 steps ahead of everyone else around him. His skills rival that of Luke and even Anakin Skywalker. However, whether or not he may be force sensitive may have more to do with a secret mission that his mother went on with Luke Skywalker. Before retiring, Shara Bey took part in one last mission with Luke Skywalker. In order to help Skywalker infiltrate an Imperial base, Bey dressed up as an Imperial officer. The Emperor stole what remained of the Force-sensitive tree that grew at the heart of the Jedi Temple on Coruscant. Pretending that Skywalker was her bodyguard, Shara Bey bluffed her way into the station's laboratories where the remains of the tree were kept. However, the commanding officer of the base realized from the very beginning that Shara Bey was not who she claimed to be. Once in the lab, Imperial officers pointed their guns at Bey and Skywalker. Nonetheless, our heroes turned the tables in their favor. Since there were two trees at the facility, Luke gave one to Shara Bey. Bey ultimately planted the tree outside her new home on Yavin 4, where she reunited with husband Kess and son, Poe Dameron. The fact that Poe grew up around this powerful, force-sensitive tree adds fuel to the theory that Poe possibly is force-sensitive, but only time will tell. Tell me in the comments below what you think. Is Poe Dameron, in your opinion, force-sensitive because of this force-sensitive tree that grew at the Jedi Temple? Or, nah, maybe not. Please like this video and help me get to a thousand subscribers by sharing this video on social media or wherever possible. And check the description box below for more videos. May the force be with you. I am John Armstrong Media and I approve this message.